Christmas, what's the real meaning of Christmas? I think John's Gospel gives us a good insight to the real meaning. Before the world was created, the Word already existed. It was with God, and it was the same as God. From the very beginning, the Word was with God. Through him, God made all things. Not one thing in all creation was made without him. The Word was the source of life, and this life brought light to mankind. God sent his messenger, a man named John, who came to tell people about the light, so that all should hear the message and believe. He himself was not the light. He came to tell about the light, so that all should hear the message and believe. He himself was not the light. He came to tell about the light. This was the real light. The light comes into the world and shines on all mankind. The word was in the world, and though God made the world through him, yet the world did not recognise him. He came to his own country, but his own people did not receive him. Some, however, did receive him and believe in him. So he gave them the right to become God's children. They did not become God's children by natural means, that is, by being born of, as children of a human father. God himself was their father. The Word became a human being and, full of grace and truth, lived among us. We saw his glory and the glory which he received as the Father's only Son. That's the meaning of Christmas. The Word became flesh and dwelt among us. A number of years ago, um, my wife and I went to the Holy Lands and did the tourist book, and we ended up in Bethlehem, the Church of the Nativity. And as you go into the church, over on one side is a hole in the wall, only a small hole, and you clamber down the steps into like a cave. And in that cave is a silver star on the floor. And inside the star there's a hole about six to eight inches diameter. And that is believed to be the spot where Jesus was born. And it was very crowded and very noisy. But after a little while, Pauline and me found ourselves all on our own. And we knelt by that star. And all of a sudden, those words, the word became flesh and dwelt among us, really hit us. And it was very emotional. It didn't last for very long because the next group of tourists came through and it became very noisy and crowded again. Is that the exact spot where Jesus was born? It's not important. The most important thing, that he came and was born. The Word became flesh and dwelt among us. During your Christmas time, when you're celebrating Christmas, just have a think. What is the real meaning of Christmas? Have a lovely new year and don't forget to get your passports, make sure they're up to date for Europe next year.